Hello and welcome to this video from Surveyor Assist, assisting you in your Surveyor journey. In this video today we're just going to go through some um, community games that are available on Surveyor. If you do like the video please like, share and subscribe and if you're not signed up to Surveyor yet there is a link in the description below if you did wish to do that. Okay let's get stuck into it then. So. Basically, there is some free community games that you can play. Um, most of them are on the Discord app or website. Uh, if you're a member of that, if not, sign up and you will be able to enter these um, free games that are available here. So we'll go through each one um, just to show you what they are. So there's a predictions game. So the prizes are weekly rare cards plus opportunity to win super rares and uniques. Um, zero cards required to play as well, which is good. So you can basically just enter these competitions for free. This is a weekly one and you've got opportunity to win rare cards and super rares and also uniques, which are obviously um, worth a lot of money. So they've put here that there's no actually actually no requirement to earn a server play card in the second longest running game that beta tests have been joined in the Discord now since March. The rules are simple. One, our previous weekly winners post up five weekend games for everyone to guess the outcomes of. Copy paste and edit your scores by 7.30 on a Friday. Prizes for the top two each week, plus if you guess five great scores. The jackpot prize is one of the game's scarcest cards, a unique card. So there's a link there to enter this th competition, but I will post all the links in the description below as well for those who did want to take part. The other one is a head-to-head -head league. So prizes vary. Managers propose and agree on entry fee prizes. Five cards required to play, so you don't need a team of five to play this one. Our Head to Head Challenge channel was recently created to help utilise player cards in collections where managers hadn't selected them for their main SO5 teams. So one, um, to, to enter this, the, the rules of the competition are one, propose or accept to join a challenge in the Discord Head to Head Challenge channel, sorry. Create your team in the gaming area in the training league, remembering to input the challenge code as your team name. There's a link there to that as well. Check the results to see how you did against your rivals. With managers able to propose their own challenge entry rules, this format is proving popular with those that are seeking yet another way to compete using their player cards. Okay, so that one sounds like a good one. Here's an example. Here, look. So this was the their team for this for the uh, week one of the nationality challenge. So this is um, players from all the same nationality. Challenge rewards so far have been either a nominal ETH amount or a nominated rare super or nominated rare play card, both of which came come secondary to the bragging rights for claiming the win. And you can enter the um, competition just by clicking the link here. Again, what I'll do is I'll actually share a link to this blog post in the description below. You will then get the links to all the competitions and obviously to the gaming area there as well. So another game we've got is the Worst Player Game. So prizes, weekly rare and super rare cards. One card required to play. So even if you only earn one card, you can join the worst player game which is also playable within the main discord channel again the rules are simple paste the url of any player card in your collection by 7 30 on a friday check the results the following week day, wednesday sorry to see if your player was the worst performing will you choose a goalkeeper that you expect to be receiving on the receiving end of a drubbing or maybe a player you think could see red or perhaps even a penalty taker that is due to miss there are always a few players each week that have a nightmare performance. The question is, can you select the worst one in advance of it happening? And there's a link there of the player. I've obviously predicted the worst player. 
that's basically just predicting the player who's going to score the lowest point in that particular game week. There's also social media competitions which range from um, rare as the prizes or super rare cards. Again, you don't need any cards to actually participate in this. So each week on the super rare Twitter and Instagram accounts, you will find a free tens competitions where you can win cards for your collection. Over the last few weeks, super rare versions of Declan Rice and Jonathan David were awarded to those that successfully predicted correct scores and their have been numerous winners of giveaways where so rare as fact those happy to share their details of the game with their friends. Okay. And again there's links there to the um to the social media competitions as well. So yeah, that is all the competitions there. So there is a few to get stuck into if you did want to um, use your cards in other ways. These are all free to play, like I say. Some require you to have cards, some you don't have to have any cards. I will include the link to this blog post in the description below so that you've got all the available links there to the relevant competitions. Okay, go have fun, enjoy some of them if you fancy having a go at some of those. Free to enter, so why not? Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like, share and subscribe. And if you've not signed up to Sora yet, there is a link in the description below. Okay, thanks for joining me and hopefully see you on the next video.